I'm Kim Midwood. I'm the Director of Graduate Studies at the Kennedy Institute. My name is Dr. Anne McKinnon. I'm the co-director of the Africa Oxford Initiative, or as we like to call it, AFOX. I'm proud to introduce the Africa Oxford Kennedy Trust Prize Studentships, which have been designed to forge interactions between the Kennedy Institute and African universities. The Kennedy Institute is a biomedical research institute. It's situated at the heart of the Old Road campus in Oxford. So the Kennedy brings together discovery science with early stage translational research. We're renowned for our research into a range of conditions, including inflammatory diseases, fibrotic diseases, cancer, and infectious disease. So the Institute holds over 200 staff and 25 different groups whose research is focused on different themes, including immunology, inflammation and tissue biology. At the Kennedy has a uniquely interdisciplinary approach where we have scientists from a clinical background, from a fundamental science background, and we research fundamental molecular mechanisms all the way up to patient translational studies. The Kennedy has developed a four-year fully funded AFOX studentship this studentship is funded by the Kennedy Trust for Rheumatology Research. Long-term objective of the Kennedy Trust for Rheumatology Research is to achieve meaningful impact in the development of cures and preventative treatments for people with musculoskeletal conditions. AFOX is a cross-university platform that draws together all of Oxford's Africa-related activity, and our vision is to make engagement with Africa a strategic priority for the University of Oxford. We do this by facilitating equitable, sustainable, and impactful collaborations between African institutions and colleagues across the university. In addition to the outstanding academic environment, AFOX also offers a range of support programs for the scholars, and this includes before they arrive to Oxford or the logistics of making your way to the university during your time, including academic support, but also social support during your time at the university and as well after you transition from the university. You will also be able to access the bespoke leadership and impact program that is offered for our folk scholars. And in addition to that, you will be part of a large community of peer supporters who will look after you during your time and after your time at Oxford. Why you should apply? I could give you three reasons, but there's multiple reasons why you should apply. One is that you get outstanding supervision from incredible mentors who are world-leading researchers in their areas of expertise. You get to work with the best of the best as it were at the University of Oxford. In addition to the academic excellence, there's also wonderful mentorship opportunities and links with industry and other institutions that are affiliated with the Kennedy Institute. The second reason you should apply is because of the access to world-class research facilities at the Kennedy Institute. You will be working with some of the leading um, cutting-edge technologies that are available in your area of expertise. And finally, there is an opportunity for career progression and support uh, within the AFOX Scholars Network. You will be part of a cohort of leading African researchers from across the university that are affiliated with AFOX. And this is not just for the time that you will be part of us at, all, at the university, but long after your studies are done. So you should definitely consider putting in an application. What does our folks look for? You, exactly. We look for students with academic merit and potential to be able to do the program that they've chosen to study, that they've thought clearly and deeply about the scientific questions that they're curious about, and I've started developing ideas about how they would go about their research. They've done the work and they've put in the effort. We also look for scholars who are committed to development of the continent, very broadly defined, that are passionate about solving big challenges in the continent and have a good reason why they want to pursue those particular big challenges. We're also excited about candidates who look to work with other people, so people who think multidisciplinarily, people who look for opportunities to collaborate, and to tag team with other people from other disciplines and other regions to be able to address the issues that they care about. So if that sounds like you, you should definitely put in an application. If you're thinking about how to apply for an AFOX studentship, please go to the Kennedy website where you can explore the AFOX projects that are listed there. AFOX applicants are encouraged to apply for any non-clinical project that's advertised and we also this year have some specific projects that are targeted 
for African universities. All of the projects will be going live online from September. So what I would encourage you to do is have a look at the website and contact any of the PIs that are hosting a project that you're interested in. They'll be ready and waiting to talk to you and that'll be the best way to find out about how you might come and work with us together at the Kennedy. Formal applications for the projects will open this September and the deadline will be December the 3rd, 2024 and we'll be interviewing early in January 2025. We're looking forward to you getting in touch with us. We believe these student shows offer an exciting opportunity to forge meaningful collaborations between the Kennedy and African universities. Look at the skills that you have and how they match to the projects that have been proposed. And also think about the tools and the technologies and the skills that you want to gain from the PhD and if those are aligned with the projects that have been proposed. After that, you can put your application through the university application process, making a strong case for why you're a good candidate, both for the project, but also for the scholarships. And once the scholars are shortlisted, they will be invited for an interview. At that interview, you get a great opportunity to really showcase your academic excellence, your understanding of the scientific concepts around those projects that you want to do, but also your capacity to be a good team player, your capacity to care about work beyond just the science and to also contribute to the development of particular areas of expertise in the continent. And after that, uh, the, the panel that meets after the interviews will then communicate to those who will point. So good luck.